Hallelujah. God bless you in Jesus' name. This is an urgent prophetic word for somebody here. God says, this is what you have been missing. This is the only thing lacking in your efforts. This is the only thing. You say, man of God, I've been praying and fasting. I've waited upon the Lord. I've read books. I've read the Bible. I've been on the mentor. I've done all I could do, but why are things not changing? This is the thing you lack. I heard from God so clear. He says, you lack consistency. You lack consistency. Every spiritual activity will only see productivity in the midst of consistency. Whatsoever you're not consistent in can never produce the best to you. Listen to me. In Joshua 1 verse 8, this book of the law should not depart from your mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day and night. Day and night. The problem is that you read today and don't read tomorrow. You read in the morning, don't read at night. If you are inconsistent, you will never see the good of God. Hallelujah. Luke 18 verse 1, men ought always to pray and not to faint. Bible says in the book of Luke, it says, and Jesus looks at the fall. He said he went to read the books in the temple as his custom was. Acts chapter 3, it says that Peter and John went to pray at the hour of prayer, at the hour of prayer, consistency better the miraculous, whatsoever you must do, you must do it until you see the result, this is your problem, you have done everything but you have not done everything with consistency this is what you are missing, if you can go back and be consistent in your prayer life, in your study life in your investment, in your career you will see the hand of God you have not lacked anything, all you are lacking is consistency. Go back and revisit the tables. Go back and revisit the books. Go back and revisit your prayer altar. God says become consistent. If you set a prayer time, stay there until it fetches the result you're looking for. This is what you're lacking. You are lacking consistency, not activity. I pray for you in the name of Jesus that you become consistent in what God has called you to do and you will see the result in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. God bless you. And I'm praying for you. I love you so much. Bye-bye.